So today on the table, I've got my little brother-in-law's Xiaomi Redmi 5A with a non-charging error. Essentially, once you plug in the charger, it shorts out whatever you, or power source you're using and accepts no charge. So inspecting the bottom of it, it does have some damaged or the plastic around the pins in the charger port doesn't look healthy at all. So I'm going to open it up and do a bit of a repair from there. So I've taken out the SIM tray and the SD tray. Now I'm just using a metal pry tool to open this one up, which the cheapest you know, is a reasonably straightforward to get open. Battling, got the back cover off. A bit of a time lapse of getting the screws out. Just, oh, you can, if you'd like, to disconnect the battery. This instance, I didn't worry about it because the phone's dead flat. So I've taken off the loudspeaker, disconnect the flex cable, the antenna, and then from there, I'll proceed to some soldering. Stuck down the charger port or charger board with some temperature control or thermal resistant tape. Right now, I'm just going to add a bit more. Well, the plan is to, on each corner, I'm going to add a little bit more solder on there to dilute it. And then I'm going to use a solder sucker to remove that from the four main mounting points of the USB micro jack. So right now, yeah, I'm heating up each corner, diluting it, and then removing the solder. So from there, that will enable me to lift it up. And my next plan is once I get a little bit of angle on it, I'm going to give it a heat hit with a heat gun, the quick 6 or 861 DW, at around about 250 degrees Celsius. And from there, I should be able to lift this jack off. I'm just using some tweezers to hopefully or slowly separate the micro USB from the board. But you've got to use enough force to separate it to lift it, but not enough that you're going to tear the five um, the five pins off at the back of the jack. Yeah, so it's lifting all right right now.
So now I'm going to get the heat gun going on it. And hopefully from there I should be able to successfully lift this off. I have applied a little bit of flux to it. So hopefully it shouldn't cause too much damage. And right now I'm trying to do an even lift rather than just reefing it off. There we go. And we're off successfully. So my next plan of attack here will be to clean up the five pins with the soldering iron. Make sure they're all in okay condition. Now, I do apologize for the quality of the video. I am just using a digital zoom here, which I am getting some new cameras hopefully late this week, early next week. So I'm getting some 4K or ye 4K cameras. That should hopefully, yeah, give a much better picture quality for these videos. So what I'm doing here now as well is just double checking the solder while removing it out of the four pins. pins cleared I'm now able just to simply drop the new replacement micro USB jack in there and that lines up nicely with the pads and then from there I'm going to give it a hit with the heat gun at around 250 degrees and then from there I'll touch it up with a soldering iron and see how I go Right now I'm just touching up the pins with the soldering iron with a little bit of solder on the end. The five pins themselves do seem to be making contact. After the video I did attempt to hook this up and it didn't short out the power but it didn't charge. What I had to do from there is put some solder paste on the pins behind the jack and hit it with the heat gun just to make that little bit of extra contact. Once that was done, I gave it a clean with the toothbrush and some isopropyl alcohol, reinstalled it back in the phone, and now it's functional once more. So this is a little rough guide on how to swap it over. It might not necessarily work for you. You might have to do a few extra steps. But yeah, a rough guide on how to replace a charger port on a Xiaomi Redmi 5A. Bye.